Shalom, family Messiah Yeshua. Shalom to the worldwide YouTube and social media community. This is your beloved brother Shaul Yisrael. Come back in with another Yahweh inspired message. I'll be reading from the book of Jasher, chapter 5, and starting at verse 6. Jasher 5 and verse 6, and I read And after the lapse of many years, in the 480th year of the life of Noah, when all those men who followed Yahweh had died away from among the sons of men, and only Methuselah was then now, El said to Noah and Methuselah, saying, Speak you, and proclaim to the sons of men, saying, Thus says Yahweh, Return from, return from your evil ways, and forsake your works, and Yahweh will repent of the evil that he declared to do to you so that, so that it shall not come to pass. For well, thus says Yahweh, because I give you a period of 120 years, if you will turn to me and forsake your evil ways, then will I also turn away from the evil what I told you, and it shall not exist, says Yahweh. I read it to say this, warning, Warning to all the sons of men. Warning, warning to all the sons of men. It is now high time for you to repent of your sins and turn from the way of transgression against Yahweh's law. For judgment is coming. Warning, warning. It is now time for you to repent. It's time for you to stop playing with our Yahweh, mercy, and his pity towards his creation. For judgment is coming. For those who are not in the ark of safety, which is the renewed man, Yeshua HaMashiach, you shall not survive the judgment to come. As Yahweh spake by his servants, Noah and Methuselah, of that time before he sent the flood. To return from your evil ways and forsake your works. So I, by the Spirit of Yahweh, in exhorting and admonishing whoso will to return from your evil ways and forsake your works that are in opposition to Yahweh. That means forsake the religions of this world. That are not in the scriptures. Forsake the wicked customs and the attitudes of the world that are separating or bring separation between you and Abba Yahweh. And submit unto the word of Yahweh. Yahweh is giving you space. Human family. Yahweh, give me space, children of Israel, of a truth. Yahweh, give me space, Gentiles, to repent and forsake your way and submit unto the way of Yahweh. In forsaking your evil ways and your unrighteous works, you must be reconciled unto Yahweh by taking on the nature and spirit of Yeshua HaMashiach through the new birth. That is, by taking on the name of Yeshua HaMashiach and water baptism, that you may receive the pardon of your sins and the regeneration of your soul. 
and receiving the baptism of the Holy Spirit as initially evident by speaking in another tongue and y'all think that's one speak that will give you a reconciled nature and spirit unto Yahweh. Yahweh is giving space to all the human family to return from your evil ways and forsake your works. So to return from your evil ways and forsake your works, that's repentance. Don't neglect the mercy that Yahweh has set before you, human family. It's time to repent of your sins and forsake your ways that are against Yahweh. Forsake the religion of this world, so there's Christianity and Islam and Judaism, and submit unto the words of Yahweh. For judgment is coming. You don't have long to keep on playing and flaunting the mercy of Yahweh. For those who are not in the ark of safety with Yeshua HaMashiach, you will not survive the judgment to come. I warn you, even weeping, that you must turn from your transgressions. You must turn from your transgressions. And be joined unto Abba Yahweh. And to be joined unto Abba Yahweh, you must be born of Yahweh. According to the new birth, as outlined in Acts chapter 2 verse 38, you must repent of your sin and be baptized. Every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for both the pardon of sins and the regeneration of your soul. And you must receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit as initially evident by speaking in another tongue and y'all permit one to speak. If you have not been baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ, then you have not received the pardon of your sins. You had not received the regeneration of your soul, meaning you're still dead in trespasses and sin. For in order for the blood of Yeshua to be applied unto you, you must go down in water in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, which grants us the pardon of our sin. And the regeneration of the soul means you are given a quickened nature that's able to commune with Abba Yahweh, that's able to be in fellowship and walk with Yahweh. And you must receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit. And there's only one initial proof that one has received the baptism of the Holy Spirit, and that is speaking in another tongue, and Yahweh permits one to speak. Yahweh is warning you, Yahweh is warning you that judgment is coming. And in order to survive, you must be in the ark of safety, which is Yeshua HaMashiach. Those who are not in the ark of safety, you won't survive. You won't survive the judgment that's coming. So warning, warning. It's time to Return from your evil ways and forsake your works. And submit unto the word of Yahweh. Yeshua instructed us. Whoso believes in him should not perish. But possess eternal life. And eternal life is Yahweh. So you believe on Yahweh. The point means of reconciliation. You must obey what he taught you. And Yeshua taught us that in order to understand and to enter the present, to be reconciled to the present and the person of Yahweh, you must be born 
again. And to be born again, you must repent of your sins. And be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ for both the pardon of sins and the regeneration of your soul. And you must receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit as initially evident by speaking in another tongue and y'all permits one to speak. This is the new birth. This is what initiates our discipleship, our union with our Yahweh, our entrance into the renewed covenant, wherein one receives both a quickened nature and a reconciled or seal spirit unto Yahweh. Don't take for granted these words. But consider them. And so choose to submit to what Yahweh says for what for man to do to be converted. To be pre-qualified for salvation. For the pre-qualification for salvation is the new birth, according to Acts 38. You don't have long. This is a warning. This is a warning to whoso will. It's time to return from your evil ways and forsake your works. That y'all have. Yahweh may have mercy upon you. That you may be spared the judgment that's coming. And to my enemies, you don't have long. Y'all had to create judgment against you. You're in is here, my enemies. He's going to bring you down. Your destruction is at hand. And your shame and contempt is complete. You are done. As thus saith Yahweh. Your oppression, your persecution, your violence against Yahweh's servant has provoked the ire of Abba Yahweh. And now your judgment is at hand. He is going to bring you down. I give Yahweh glory, honor, and praise for vindicating, vindicating me, his servant, for granting me an opportunity to be kind of worthy to suffer persecution at the hands of a multitude of devils. In the name of Yahweh's beloved son, Yeshua HaMashiach, so be it, so be it, 